Hey y'all, welcome to the second half with Hey Marie, where the vibe is peace, love, and prosperity. If you are new to the channel and you catch a vibe, please make sure that you share, like, and subscribe. And if you're a returning sub, thank you for your continued support. I want to come to you with a layering combination that I just happened upon. I tried these two fragrances by themselves and they were just a little underwhelming. They didn't really do too much. And so I was like, okay, they're both in white bottles. So why don't we mix them? I don't know. Maybe it'll work. Maybe it won't. But I also knew that the scent profiles, like there were some uh, notes in each scent that they were similar. So I was like, okay, because you know, if you're new to the channel, maybe you don't know, um, but I love a beast mode fragrance, right? I want you to smell me before I get there. I want you to smell me when I'm gone. I want you to smell me in your mind. I want you to just smell me, right? And um, I've been underwhelmed lately. Like I just have not been finding these beast mode fragrances. It's like, how long do these things have to sit in my collection before they may macerate and become what they're supposed to be. But anywho, neither here nor there, right? So the two fragrances that I have uh, combined together, now this scent may not work for you, but this is a layering combination, combination that I find to be pleasant. I got compliments on it. It was a beast mode after I mixed them together and sprayed 20 of this and 20 of that. And um, they just worked well. So the two frags that I have are going to be both by Latafa. And this one is uh, Batty Al Oud, Honor and Glory. And this one is uh, Rave Now White, okay? And um, let me just go ahead and I have notes on these. I'm not gonna take you to the Fragrantica website because I just don't have time right now. But- the notes on this. Now, again, this one for me leans a little masculine, uh, I, definitely both unisex, but this one just leans a little more masculine. This, the pineapple in there, it's doing the most and um, it just has uh, some masculine vibes to it. And so I thought maybe adding this would kind of soften it a little bit and it just worked for me. Right. So uh, let's go ahead and do the rave now. So for the rave now, this is a spring summer scent. It is unisex. It has 4.17 um, out of five. This was released in 2023. It is a Latafa. If I didn't say that top notes are grapefruit and bergamot. Mid notes, green apple and patchouli. And then the um, base note is going to be musk and cashmere. Now, I do want to just throw this out here because sometimes we get on here and we can be a little intimidating to um, people that are new to the fragrance community because we get on here and we act like we know all the fragrances and we talk to, about them as if it was just a part of our DNA and we know. So Casmirin, I have no idea what that is and most of you guys don't either. So let's stop pretending like we automatically know. We have to do our research to find out what some of these notes are. This is a synthetic fragrance there uh, or note. There are no casmirin plants or roots or trees. This is a synthetic fragrance or note that is add to, added to the fragrances for a warm, woody, musky scent with a floral and spicy undertone. Now, I don't know that because I have 200 fragrances. I know that because I Googled it, right? So guys, I do want to say to you, do not be intimidated by some of these fragrance reviewers that get on here and they just speak about the notes and the this and the that. They're probably reading from a card, right? Or some of them do actually know because they've done research, but I'm one of those people that, you know, there's some notes that I, you know, pineapple, I can identify that. Coconut, I can identify that. The scents that I really love, I can identify that. Never heard of cashmere and just wanted to put you up on that. Okay. So the next one is going to be the Batty Al Oud Honor and Glory, right? So this is a spring summer scent. It is unisex. It got 4.32 um, votes out of five. Um, this is the top notes, pineapple, cream brulee. Now I will say this is a creamy scent. 
where this is a juicy scent that just think about this as being kind of watery, right? A juicy scent where this is creamy and thick. Um, that's the difference in my opinion about these two. So anyway, this one is pineapple cream brulee top notes, mid notes, cinnamon, benzoin, and black pepper. And then the mid, the uh, base note is vanilla, sandalwood. Again, that casmere and then moss. Now, the only thing that these, the only notes that these two have in common is going to be that casmere and again, that's that warm, woody, musky scent with the floral and spicy undertone. However, in my opinion, these two work together. Like they just smell really good. And I really was only pulling them together because I was like, okay, this is in a white. This is white. This is white. I wore them separately and I was underwhelmed. So let's put them together and see what kind of vibe I get. And I put them together and I loved it. I had one of my uh, teacher friends. She was like, what is that? And I told her, of course, you know, they're not really up on Middle Eastern fragrances. She was like, you need to write that down. I got to get that. That smells so good. And I was like, job well done. Okay. So anywho, I'm talking fast guys, because I got to go to work. Okay. And, um, I'm happy about it. I will go to work smelling good. I hope that you, uh, what caught my, uh, previous video. Um, I did a, uh, review on Okja's candy collection. That's what I'm wearing now. I'm actually not wearing this. I just wanted to get this in. Um, and also check out my rant on um, the first lady's teacher uh, dinner with teachers, because that was just like, I hope that you guys had some serious conversations there because uh, the teaching profession is going downhill. But anywho, that's a whole nother story that we don't have time for. If you have this in your collection, experiment with it play with it, and then leave me some comments and let me know if this was a layering combination that worked for you, because it definitely worked for me. That was on yesterday when I wore this. Okay, so anyway, guys, um, please make sure that you love yourself first, because if you don't love yourself, nobody else will, or they will, and they'll pretend like they do, but they really don't. So love yourself first, so you won't be disappointed. Make sure that you teach people how to treat you, because if you don't teach them how to treat you, they'll just treat you any old way, okay? And with that, guys, I wish you peace, love, and prosperity, and I am out. Mm -hmm.